these five people now linked to a string of robberies in the city and possibly other states. Investigators received these surveillance pictures after the group stole more than $30,000 from an area antique mall. Now, one business told Eyewitness News anchor Sarah Rosario it'll be ready if they come back again. They're items you can't find at a regular store. Resettler's Antique Mall has everything from rare collectibles to expensive jewelry. Vendors let the store sell the items for them. But after a recent theft, the owner is worried business could be in jeopardy when vendors started pulling their items out. He took uh, all of his really handsome items out of the showcase and took them home. He'll. Um, You'll find another venue of getting rid of it. Linda Sly was working when four people seen here in these surveillance pictures stole more than $30,000 worth of jewelry. They came in here. Sly says it was two couples, one who distracted her. He wanted this and that and this. And the other who stole the items. Police say another person was outside in a getaway car. This is the case where the jewelry was taken from. Police say the suspects used some type of tool to pry this glass open before they took the items and left. Since then, the owner has taken extra security measures to make sure that this doesn't happen again. We have the security and we had that upgraded. Um, we have second locks on the cases. All expensive items are now locked away. Police say the group could be responsible for two other robberies in Statesville, one at Gregory Jewelers, another at Statesville Jewelry and Loan, and two more out of state. With the information we're getting now from Pennsylvania and Maryland, it's highly unlikely they're local. Well, I want them to get caught, and I would like, I would like for them, uh, I'd like to talk to them. Sarah Rosario, Channel 9 Eyewitness News. Once again, let's give you another look at the surveillance pictures. If you recognize any of these people, please call police.